what we have here um, are um, organic mung beans in here. It's a half a cup and we have a half a cup of organic wheat berries right here and then we're also going to do some um, lentils half a cup. It's a half a cup each. All you need to have is a couple different kinds of your favorite varieties. Some people like alfalfa seeds for alfalfa sprouts. Some people like sunflower seeds for sunflower seed sprouts. Whatever you like. Today what we're going to do is we're just going to put the seeds in a jar and um, we're going to let them sit overnight. Okay, so the sprouts have um, soaked overnight and now what we're going to do is we're going to rinse them and so they'll start sprouting. And what I use is one of these mesh um, nets that I put over it like this. See, catches all the seeds, and then I rinse them. Like that. And be sure to do this twice a day. I usually do it in the morning and in the after dinner. And now the next thing that you do is you take your screening and you just put it over like this with your rubber band and turn it over like this. I put a little towel right here on the side. They should be a little bit in the light like this. And that way they'll start sprouting. By tomorrow you'll see, by the next day you will see um, little sprouts already on the wheat berries. Those only take three days. The mung beans take about three to four days and um, so do the um, lentils. And then I'll rinse them again this evening after dinner and that's it. This is the second day and here's what they look like. They all have a little bit, if you look real closely, let me see if I can focus the camera. You can see that they're starting to get the little white on them is little sprouts. These wheat sprouts will be ready by tomorrow on the third day. And then here's the mung bean sprouts. They also have a little bit of a sprout on them, but they won't be ready tomorrow. They need to be a little bit longer. And we'll show you what they look like on that day. And then the um, lentils have a sprout on them also, as you can see. We all know that whole wheat bread is good for you when you grind your own wheat from wheat berries. Wheat sprouts are about a hundred times better for you than eating whole wheat bread. Wheat sprouts, vitamin B is like almost tripled when it's sprouted. Okay, here's the sprouts on the third day of sprouting. As you can see, the wheat berries have a little um, white sprout on the end. They're ready for eating now. And the um, lentils and the mung beans will be ready by tomorrow. As you can see, this is really easy. You just put them in the jar. I use these small peanut butter jars. And just rinse them twice a day. It's day four. And this is what the sprouts look like on day four. They're all ready for eating. Um, I made a little salad. It's um, an, a tomato and cucumber with some fresh basil and garlic that I'm going to put a tablespoon of each on also. And it's like taking your vitamins but better because these are better for you. They're, they taste better. You get to eat them. They're alive, they're packed with vitamins and minerals, 